Hi, I'm Daniel from BHG Marine in Lymington, and today I'm going to be giving you an overview tour of Moonraker, a ribeye S785 powered by Yamaha 300 horsepower outboard engine. As mentioned, the rib features the new Yamaha B generation 300 horsepower outboard engine. It's a 4.2 litre V6 giving speeds of about 50 knots on this particular hull. All presented in very good condition. Yamaha stainless steel prop. No major marks or scratches on the engine. This particular engine also features the latest Yamaha digital controls, giving fly-by-wire throttle and gear shifts for a much smoother driving experience. Moonraker has the impression tubes these are the matte finish fabric style tubes. She looks stunning with the flexi teak decking and the red upholstery. She also features a stainless steel wakeboarding A-frame on the back with high ski point, as well as a wakeboard and water ski rack over to the port side. The rear A-frame also features stainless steel cleats and mooring and LED navigation lights and of course the uh, VHF antenna on the top. So we're now inside the boat, we'll take a closer look at the console and the electronics this boat has. First off and quite prominent is the Garmin GPS chart plotter, that's a Garmin EchoMap 70S. It gives you GPS charts as you can see here, currently ashore at Lymington. Also gives you sonar, which won't work as we're ashore, but that will give you depth and also have a image of the uh, seabed there, water temperature. Currently, it's chilly 0 0.8 degrees sea ashore. Great little chart plotter, seven inch touch screen, a really good size when you're underway and directly in your line of sight above the helm. We've also got the Yamaha engine instrumentation. Digital tacker gives you engine revs, trim up the side here, uh, engine hours as well, uh, battery voltage, oil pressure and water temperature. Speed and fuel meter, of course, gives you your speed, your fuel gauge up the side, also fuel flow, litres per hour, uh, and total fuel used on each journey. Compass, fusion stereo system, Unidock, which has the uh, USB slot and a little uh, house for an iPad or an iPhone, or Android device as well now. That has Bluetooth built in as well, so you have Bluetooth and uh, iPod USB audio, as well as radio. Bilge pump controls, a useful glove box for storage, and the Garmin VHF radio down there as well. It's a DSC VHF radio currently giving us our position. Yamaha digital electronic control. Again, this is all drive by wire, nice and smooth, easy to operate. And our switch panel. Switches for navigation lights, deck lights that sort of thing. And the Yamaha ignition switch with kill cord here as well. Steering of course is hydraulic steering, nice and easy to operate, very very smooth, very free. Nice ribeye sport steering wheel as well. So we mentioned deck lights on the switches, this boat has the LED deck lights. They are blue, you can just about see. Six lights in total illuminating the deck, looks really nice at night. The grey gel coat looks great against the teak and the red upholstery looks fantastic. It's called Moonraker. The upholstery itself is in excellent condition. I haven't seen any rips or tears or any signs of wear on the upholstery whatsoever. In the locker, just storage space with the battery switch. In the bow, another big cushion. Easy access to the anchor roller and cleat. And underneath the cushion, we have access to the anchor locker itself.
Perspex windscreen, good condition, no cracks, no UV damage. The boat, of course, has been stored with a cover on, so everything inside the boat is in really good condition. Stainless steel is all good. And we have a clever, this clever helm seat. So currently it's operating as a leaning bolster. So you're at the helm and you can stand leaning against this. And then people in the back can sit face to face across the uh, table. So this can be lifted using these very simple buttons on the side to release. You will need two hands. <laughs> there we go. To allow you to be seated at the helm. It also gives you quite a bit more room here on deck. Of course, much more room when you haven't got the table in position. The table's a teak table with a stainless steel leg. Has been in the locker a bit damp, but uh, that would dry out to a more uniform teak colour. Again, we've got that same red upholstery across the back in excellent condition. You've got the backrest, then you've got the additional backrest support tube across the back as well. The seat now on the modern ribeyes is on a gastra, so it holds itself up. So the only damage I have seen to the upholstery on this boat is this very small nick just here. It's not really noticeable. Could be stitched up. Otherwise, it's absolutely spotless. Storage locker with the bilge pump down there as well. Plenty of room to stow the table when you're not using the table. And there's an A-frame as well. So Moonraker has been stored on its trailer, so the hull is not anti-fouled. She's showing its original gel coat in excellent condition. Small mark there on the front where it's caught something, but uh, very, very minor and superficial. Otherwise, she's in really good condition. Nice to see a hull that hasn't been anti-fouled. It means if you're going to keep it on the trailer or in a dry stack, you don't have to worry about the uh, old anti-foul drying out and looking horrible over time. With the various deck drains and bilge pump outlets across the back. Again, hull, very good condition, just a couple of small minor marks is to be expected with a bit of use. So the engine, I'll give you a closer look at all the trim, trim rams, excellent condition, no damage or wear to the trim rams or the cap seals, or the caps themselves. There's a couple of very minor marks there to the lower, ca lower cowling, otherwise perfect. So we'll give you a tour of the tubes. They're looking very damp at the moment because it had the cover on and it's uh, currently zero degrees. So uh, it looks a bit patchy with the damp patches on the tubes. They are in very good condition. Certainly no repairs, no scuffs, no wear that I've seen on the tubes anywhere. Nice color scheme with the gray on the top, black rubbing striker, and the gray fabric underneath. and the monochrome logos as well. So the trailer is included 
with Moonraker. It is an original ribeye trailer. All in good condition. Our engineers can of course provide a, a complete uh, report, inspection report on the trailer as required. So that is Moonraker, available on brokerage from BHG Marine here in Livington. If you'd like any further information, you can use our contact details in the text below or visit our website at www.bhg-marine.co.uk. Thank you for watching.